It's been a day, stressing out like crazy. Just wanna be lazy with my girls. It's been a day, we gonna get wavy. Layer Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I am going to be doing a testing video review on the Turkish Delight palette from Makeup Revolution. This is one that I opened in my unboxing video on the Superdrug haul and it's this stunning one. So if that's something that you fancy watching then uh, please stay tuned. So first up I'm going to show you these gorgeous gorgeous colours. So we've got all of these which I think are just beautiful. I did swatch, uh, I can't remember how many, a few colours in the unboxing video so if you want to look at the swatches then go and check that one out i'll link it above but yeah so do you know what i'm thinking looking at these i really really want to do like a a khaki pinky look maybe with a tiny bit of gold thrown in so yeah i think i'm going to go with something like that so obviously i've completely done my base please ignore my nails i'm doing them tonight they have lasted well, but um, yeah, I'm going to sort them out later. Anyway, yeah, so I've done my base as far as obviously my eyeshadow. So I'm going to pop that on. So I've got some P. Louise primer on my eyes. And that's in the shade Rumor 0.5. Just roll up my sleeves. I mean business. <laughs> what? <laughs> right, okay. So first of all in the crease, I'm going to go in with a, a bit of a transition shade. I'm quite liking the look of this one here in the corner, T it's called. They've got really funky names actually, they're all like Turkish names. So I'm going to go in with that one just on a large fluffy brush. I'm going to use this mirror. So I'm going to do this eye. Oh, a bit of crease in there in the older primer. That's a really nice transition shade. I have to say, nice and pigmented as well. Okay, like that. Then with the same fluffy brush, I'm gonna go in with this shade here called Pomegranate and I'm gonna use that just above my crease. Okay, right, then all over the main part of my lid, I'm going to go in with this colour here called Mint. Yeah, Mint, which actually looks a bit more like a, a khaki green. I just want to double check that that's, yeah, that's nice. It's like a, a brownie green. I'm going to take that all over my lid. Okay, like that. I'm oh, God, I'm loving that green. Absolutely love that. Goes on really, really nice and it's really buildable as well. It's got really intense khaki colour. Really, really nice. Right, so what I'm gonna do. I don't know whether to just leave it. It's kind of gone like a cut crease without actually mapping it out with any concealer as well. So I don't know whether to leave it like that. Do you know what I am? I'm just going to leave it like that. But what I'm going to do on the outer corner, I want to use one of these glitters. And I'm really liking the look of that um, baklava, that one there. And I love baklava as well. Oh, it's so good. Right, okay, so what I'm going to do on the outer corner, I'm going to try something I've not tried before, and I don't think I've actually seen it myself. I'm sure it's been done, but I haven't seen it myself in a tutorial. And I'm going to go in with this shimmer here, this shimmer just here called Dates. I'm going to use that on my outer corner. I'm going to put that on a fluffy brush again. Hope this goes on. 
So I'm just going to pop this. That's really nice. Right, so I'm just gonna keep keep going, but I'm gonna kind of blend and put it on at the same time till I get where I want it. Rather be much better if we stayed in touch. You and me, but it was too late. I can't make you stay. Yeah, that's good. Really, really like that. Really like it. Right, okay. So then just on the underneath, do you know what? I'm going to go in with this green shade here called Bergamot, which is kind of like a mid, mid green, I'd say. Just going on with a pencil brush. Okay. Yeah, that's nice as well. Right, and then on the inner corner, we've got a frosty shimmer. Yeah, oh, wow, look at that. Like twist. This one here. Yeah, you can't really see it. I can never get highlighter colours to show up on the camera. Oh, God, maybe lost you then. Right, so on the same pencil brush, I'm just going to take some of that shimmer right on my inner corner. Like that, I'm just going to pop a little bit under my brow as well. Like that. Really, really nice. I don't know how that's coming off on camera, but really, really like that. Really, yeah. <laughs> I'm happy. Right, okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to repeat the same on the other eye and pop some mascara on and probably some lipstick and then I will be back. So there we go. There's the rest of the makeup on. I'll uh, just give you a quick close-up of the eyes. I have to say I am really, really happy with them. Really, really happy. It applied, I have to say, the, the eyeshadow is applied really similar to the Avocado palette, which I also really liked. I've done that in a separate video as well. And I have to say, these, these colours did remind me of that. I didn't use any of the loose glitters like I did in the other one. Um, but I have to say, the shimmers, well, this shimmer anyway, went on like an absolute dream. And to say, I, well, I tried using my finger, but I didn't really need to. They just went on beautifully and they blended so well and the pigment mm, is fantastic really really like this palette cannot recommend it enough and the colors are just gorgeous so uh yeah really really happy with that and i think i think i actually got it on three for two so it was even cheaper if not free but um i'm sure it's only about nine quid normally you can't go wrong can you really so yeah so there we go, there is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and ding the bell for future notifications. I usually upload on a Monday, Wednesday and a Friday at around 6 p.m. So I hope to see you there. Thanks for watching, bye.